For this next exercise, we use a job that's already been set up with the wrap tool gadget. Notice that the job size is same as we had set up when we did a three and a half inch diameter column, 16 inches long. Now we're going to create some text. Use the draw text and let's do letters A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. Let's go ahead and anchor these at 5.5 at 14.5. Those appear. Now let's go ahead and do another set of text. This time we'll do the numbers 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Again, 1 inch text, courier new. This time we're going to anchor it at 5.5 and at Y.5. We hit apply shows up there. Let's select both sets of text. Let's go over to the Create VCarve and we will use a 90 degree tool path. Let's kill result. Let's build and turn on the paths. Now let's see what happens when we turn on the rotary axis tool. So we go to view, turn on the material block, and then view tool path drawing wrapped X values around Y axis. Notice that the tool shows up. To make this a little easier to see, let's look at the isometric view. And we see that the letter A, B, C wraps around clockwise to the letter J. Likewise on the numbers, 0, 1, 2, 3 wraps around clockwise to the number 9. And that's the impact of turning on the view, toolpath drawing, wrap x values around y-axis.